Hello, today I'm here with a new video and if you don't know who I am, my name is Lisa and I am a cruelty for YouTuber that is trying to have a year long no buy and today I... Okay, it, I, I haven't filmed for like a month, I haven't had a video up for like two weeks I feel a little bit out of it but I'm here, I'm ready to make a video, I'm ready to put on makeup, I haven't had eyeshadow on for oh I don't even know how long and uh, yeah I think we just get started and I guess this is going to be one of my rambling get ready with me's as normal I have no idea what to talk about but I guess we're going to get there I don't know so okay in this video I'm going to test a new thing I have actually bought like my first makeup product for this year yes um, if you saw my latest video, I did talk about that I wanted to um, be clearing this one, the Tone Activator Eye Primer from Kaleidos. And I have. I just haven't thrown it away yet. This doesn't work for me, like, at all. My eyes should crease like crazy. And I was like, yeah, I have some other at home. And I have this one. This is the Proof It Waterproof Eyeshadow Primer from NYX. This is like glue. So this... It was so hard to work with eyeshadows. I think this is going to be perfect for a cut crease or something. But putting on eyeshadows with this one, it didn't work. So, I actually bought a new eyeshadow primer. I bought this one, the Crease Killer from Gloss Gods, a Swedish brand. And I do really hope that this is good. I have heard really good things about it. I bought the shade... I think I picked up the lightest one I think it's the white one and I think it's what shade 4 yeah uh, I think they have 4 different shades so the 4 is white it looks like white at least and then more like yeah number 1 is deeper yep. okay so I'm going to try this today and I'm thinking about Either using this one, the Wildness palette from Beauty Bay, or my side to side palette from Nabla. But I think I might going to give this a new try. I don't know if if it is the best to test an eyeshadow prime, a new eyeshadow primer with eyeshadow the eyeshadow palette that I've used once. I don't know what to do with this. There's so many colors, but I don't know. I don't know what I want to do. Maybe something green. Am I into green today? So, I need to change the battery as well. <laughs> it's going great. I will put on my eyeshadow primer. Maybe you won't see that. Okay, is this... Oh, I shouldn't have bought the white one. Okay, and do you like understand how pale I am when a white eyeshadow base doesn't look too off on me so we will see how this battery is because this wasn't fully charged either I guess that is what's happening when you're not filming okay I'm just going to try to do something with this palette I don't know what yet maybe it's going to be like a brownish look we will see but yeah if you wonder how everything is with me today it's Today is a good day and uh, I did write on my community page that I was going to take a little break because I just haven't gotten the energy to film like at all and I haven't had the energy to do anything honestly like during June, July, July, it's July and uh, I have been working so much this month has been one of the worst month ever at work and I have been working there for 11 years it has been we are 11 people at my department when it was the worst we were only five so 
it has been so much work and I was like, I'm not going to be able to keep up with the filming and keep up with YouTube at all. And I haven't touched makeup, like, at all during this month. And, uh, yeah, I just announced that I was going to have a break. And now, I am finally on vacation. Techni technically, it hasn't started yet because it's Saturday today and it's I shouldn't... Even if I did, did not have my vacation, I wouldn't have gone to work today. So it's technically start on Monday, but yeah. I am in vacation mood and it feels so fucking great. Yesterday after work, me and my boyfriend, we ordered pizza. There is, in the town I live, at least two places that has a vegan. I think it's three places, but two, yeah, three places that has vegan pizza. And I've never ordered it. We have only made pizza at home for the last like year and it was actually really good so we did order pizza yesterday and I did cut my bangs I I think it went good I haven't been that doing that like I've cut my bangs myself since I got it in May but like in June my hair grows kind of fast and especially my bangs because you can see it's in the middle of my face so my bangs was like down to here and yesterday before I got to bed I cut it I cut it with a busser? shaving machine? is it called busser? it, it, it became kind of crooked <laughs> so my boyfriend he had to help me this morning to make it straight and I think it's good. I do think it looks really really short but I think I'm starting to get used to it. I guess it's, it, it has been so long. It was like three centimeters longer yesterday so I'm just guess that I'm not used to it. Okay, I do really like this shade and I think that the eyeshadow primer is working good. Um, so yeah, during July, I have like only working like 19 hours a day. Been so tired when I have gotten home and it hasn't been good. But now I like already feel more relieved and uh, yeah, it just feels really good that I don't have to go back to work. And then until the end of... August and I'm really happy about that with like living in Sweden because at almost every work here in Sweden you are allowed to have five weeks paid vacation every year if you work full-time at least and it feels <laughs> really good to have that so yeah, I'm taking out three and a half weeks and I don't know if we're going to do anything special. I know that we're going to see my mom and dad and my brother. My brother and his girlfriend is coming to visit us. Other than that, I don't know. I just want to take a chill and like <laughs> relax because I've been working so much this year. And... Uh, Yeah, I still haven't gotten my passport. I don't know if I've talked about that, but it's like a passport chaos in Sweden. And uh, we didn't plan to go outside of Sweden or travel to any other country this summer, but yeah. During the pandemic, people haven't like renewed their passport, so and the passport is valid for five years in Sweden. So everybody's, this is not even fun to hear. But yeah, too many people did want a new passport this year and mine did actually, um, get old, went out. It was not valid anymore this summer, so 
Yeah, I have uh, fixed a new one, but it's going to take like after 10 weeks to get it, so yeah. So we are have uh, not planned anything more than uh, visiting my parents. And I uh, have my boyfriend, my brother and his girlfriend here. Uh, and that feels really good for me because yeah, I just guess I need to relax. And I also want to try to find my, back way, my way back to YouTube, <laughs> finding my way back to speaking English again. That is always like the hardest one you've taken a break with YouTube. My English, mm. it's a little bit so and so. It just always feels so strange to film again when you haven't like been filming for a really long time. It's like I don't know how to act, and um, yeah, I, I don't know. It's now I don't know. Do I want to have a matte look or do I want to take a shimmer? But what kind what kind of shimmer? I don't want to take a black shimmer and I don't think I want to take a green shimmer. How about this? Is this boring maybe? Maybe I should take a green shimmer. Ooh. That looks nice. How about this? That is more like a topper. Ooh, this looks even nicer. So either the green one or this blue one. Maybe she take this one. That is ocean. So yeah, I don't know what more to talk about. I I just felt like when I woke up this morning, like I want to do a YouTube video today, and I guess I'm going to have so much to talk about, and I'm sitting here and I'm like I have nothing to talk about. Maybe I can just update you on my low buy or my no buy situation because I don't think that I will do. I think I just threw it in here in this video because I want to find a more fun way to talk about my no buys but I haven't yet, so it's still going good. This this eyeshadow primer is the only thing that I have bought so far, makeup wise, except for a new mascara and a new sponge. And uh, yeah. I don't have anything more to say. It has been really easy this month because I haven't, because I worked so much. I have come home, watched YouTube or playing like some games on my phone. Me and my boyfriend, we have been watching True Blood all over again. And yeah, that is what I have done this month there is nothing more to you to talk about nothing more excited has happened in my life actually nothing at all but now okay i think i like this now i really hope that i have energy to do something after work because i haven't the only thing I've done things are like on weekends, I've seen some friends and uh, yeah, <laughs> that's it. But okay, should we do the base together or maybe not? Maybe this is enough like for, I always think it's hard when you're like coming back even though I haven't, it hasn't been that long, it has been like two weeks without a video. Uh, but I always think like it's hard to make the first video when you're back again because it feels like you n need to talk about what you have done and why you haven't been on YouTube. But at the same time, I don't think that I have been 
that missed in one sense. I hope that you get what I mean. I haven't been off for like weeks and weeks and months. And maybe not everybody even have noticed that I haven't put it up something. But for me it feels a really long time because I haven't filmed for this whole month and um, it just feels a little bit odd to be back and filming again, speaking English again, doing my makeup again because I haven't done it. So yeah, or okay, one other thing that I actually have been doing this month, I have been to a concert. It has been years since I was on concert. Concert? Uh, it was three of my favorite bands that was playing um, a little bit, yeah, it took like one hour to drive there and it was so fun. It was the sounds Mando Diao and the Hives, if you know how they are, and they have been my favorite band since like 20 years back or something. Also, that was really fun, even though my anxiety was, was with me, <laughs> but it it went good and it felt good to do at least something. But okay, I'm going to fix my base off cam and then I'm going to wrap this video up because I don't, yeah, as I said, I don't know what more to talk about. So yeah, I see you soon. So this is the finished look for my waterline. As always, I did use Honeydew from Colourpop on my lips. I did take Anemia from Lethal and then I took never remember the name. Crystallize from Kaleidos. This is one of their lip glosses. I tried to match it with this shimmer in here and I know how well that did. But yeah, this is the finished look and the eyeshadow primer, it still looks good. As so I will see how this will hold up today. And about the palette, I talked in my eyeshadow palette collection video that I don't know if I would keep this palette and if I'm going to be honest, Still don't know, don't know if I'm like super thrilled about it, doesn't feel like super special or it's maybe just me. But <laughs> yeah, that was all for this video, I do hope that you have liked it. I, it, as for right now it feels like I want to film really really much, I don't know if that's just because I haven't filmed for a while, a little while. but we will see. I hope that you're happy to see me again. It's... Uh, I don't know what to say. <laughs> Is it always like this? Do I always have such a hard time with speaking English? Maybe I do. But yeah, I really hope you like this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do so you don't miss any of my videos and I hope that I will see you in the next one. Bye!